All right, hey everybody. In this video, I wanted to um, talk about some suspensions and hammer-ons and pull-offs. A lot of people really wanted to uh, learn more about those things. So uh, I'm going to start in the playing a D chord. There's a lot of cool things you can do just within a D chord. So here's your D chord, and uh, I'd say the most popular suspension is the four. I hear you see su sus four all the time, meaning. All that's meaning is, so if you're in D, you're suspending the fourth chord, which would be your G, and that would be uh, held by your pinky here, sitting on the G note. So there's your sus4 in D. Let go of that, back to D. Sus2, just let go of your middle finger, and you're suspending the E. doing there is a hammer-on as I'm hammering the middle finger back on the F sharp note so basically with a hammer-on the note that you land on is not being strummed with your right hand so I'm, I'm playing the E, the e note with my right hand and then I'm hammering sorry I'm hammering on with my middle finger on the F sharp I'll try to get that better. So I'm not playing it with this finger, with this, with my right hand. I'm literally just hammering. So like this. There's your hammer on, and then your pull off is the opposite. So I'm literally I'm playing this suspended D chord, and then I'm pulling my pinky off to get back to the D. So you're this time you're not playing the chord you land on. So pulling off, you're actually, what you're doing here is you're pulling down with your middle finger and then away. I'll try to zoom in on that here. So you're pulling down and away, not so aggressively, but just do it, doing it fast there. hammer-on and pull-offs, and it's very popular with C as well, so there's your C chord. Now if you want to turn it into a sus4, you hammer on the pinky right underneath your ring finger, which turns it into almost like an F chord, so. And this is, this is a whole song I've heard before with just these two. sus2 down here to the D. You know, there's your beginning chord of Dust in the Wind. And then, you know, A is another popular one. Add your pinky there. Let go of your ring finger and you're in suspending too. chord major. It's a little tight squeeze here, but if you put your pinky right underneath your ring finger, which would be the second fret on the G string, there's your sus4. And, you know, a lot of tips I give people is to just drop your right hand sometimes if you want to practice some of these chord movements just practice it with your left hand I gave this tip to someone and they told me it, it really helped to just practice their chord changes with their left hand for a while before even worrying about your right hand because that's just another obstacle to think about you know and so just practicing this over and over for a while and Take your time, it'll really make some differences. Okay guys, thank you. That was uh, hammer-ons, suspensions, and pull-offs. See you on the next one.